Okay, we're here at 10634 Fitzroy Avenue in Tahunga. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. You'll have the general inspector crawl underneath the house and he's physically going to look at everything. Uh, what I can tell you is we've tried to run the, the camera from these roof vents, the cast iron roof vents on the roof. None of them would allow us to get into the sewer line. So what we're doing is we're running our camera from this two-inch ABS roof vent, and we were able to get into the line. However, there's a, there was an incorrect fitting underneath the house that took us <coughs> upstream <coughs> instead of downstream. So what we're looking at right now is the end of the line of the sewer line underneath the house. And as we bring the camera back, because if you come back, you'll see there's the connections <coughs> that and, and actually what's going on is we're going upstream instead of downstream and the reason why we're doing that is because there's an incorrect fitting right over here right stop right over go forward a little bit right over here now what we'll do is we'll try throw it in again see if we can maybe go the right way try again No, 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 you're going the wrong way. Okay, let's bring this back here. So something's not right underneath this house. Whoever did the plumbing under this house is, uh, didn't do a proper job, that's for sure. Because that T is not a directional fitting anyway. So we're going to keep coming back up the roof vent. And what we're going to do is we're going to, we saw a clean out underneath the house that we'll try to run our camera from anyway. Coming up the roof vent right over here. Uh, I'm going to pause the recording. Uh, none of the other roof vents are working. So I think what we'll do is just pause the recording. Okay, so what we've done is we've got my guy underneath the house. He loosened up the clean out. That's all the way in the back of the house, the original cast iron pipe. And he's underneath the house there. And we've got our camera in all the way to the city connection in the street. So there's the city sewer right there. You can see it flowing by. Now, um, we're going to bring the camera back from here. So there's the city connection. We're going to bring the camera back. Looks like there's like a rag in the, or a piece of, piece of paper or whatever. That's why we always recommend never to flush tampons, baby wires, paper towels. As the sewer line, it's a big six inch clay lateral coming back from the middle of the street towards the property. And this appears to be in good condition. Now the, the piping outside the house, the clay pipe is, looks like it's in good condition. There's also a clean out at the property line, which we'll show you when we get to it. But this is the big six inch pipe that's in very clean. Comes onto the property to a four inch clay pipe. This is also in pretty good condition. A little bit of roots over there, very minor roots. There's the clean out that's in the front. And then it comes back to the four inch clay pipe which is running through the front this is all in good condition nice and clean remember this is all based on my opinion as we keep coming back now right over here right there is where it exits the house right by the gas meter there i put some green paint there and then it comes back to a very old cast iron pipe, extremely old pipe, which is now going to start coming underneath the house. Very old cast iron pipe. You can see there how paper and stuff gets caught in the line. This is very old, this pipe, with pretty heavy rust buildup. 
we're going to recommend all this to be replaced over here. Then I come back to ABS plastic. That over there, that's the T that I was talking about that was an illegal fitting over there because that is not directional fitting. Uh, okay, and then we come back to some ABS plastic. This is all looks pretty good over here. Now, probably some of the plumbing. And then it comes to cast iron over here at the back and comes out of the clean out underneath the house. So we're going to go ahead and stop the recording over here.